Bear on the coin hunter. This is part two from part one because part two is not uploading right that I made last night. And last night I found out that I actually had a DDR004. This is a 2009 um, Lincoln's uh, Lincoln scent. I'm going to use a pointer here. And if you look, you can see right here the faint outline of the finger right there on this penny. So I go here to Variety Vista and you can see right there there's that outline right there. So that's me just going back and double verifying everything. So, so this list is DDR004, comma, 4 dash R dash V111. So I'm going to pause the video for a second because I'm going to bring up some other stuff. Okay, I'm back. I went to this coin shop and he told me I can do this. This is Kevin. He's out here in Central near where I live at. And there's this website, buyyoucoinsupplies.com. This is a website. And I picked up some Indian heads and some buffalo nickels. But he also had these were people cut apart their mint sets. So we got a 61 Jefferson. I think that's this should be a 62 Jefferson. So let's see with the plastic. Yeah, I don't know if it's a Philly or not. Hold on. Philadelphia. We got us a 64. A 61 Philly. And 63 Philly. This is where people cut the sets apart. And he sells these at a reasonable price. What I'm doing, I'm slowly gearing up. So I'm waiting for something to occur to where I'm going to start selling on whatnot. And I'll have these, these type of items for sale. And these are in pristine condition. This one's going to start getting a gold tint to it. I'm assuming it's from the plastic. This one's on the reverse. It's got a little bit of a gold tinge coming on. Uh, like I said, I think this is on the plastic. So, I'm working on that. I'm working on building a stock of Indian head, buffalo nickels. I'm getting some silver nickels from another coin shop. I'm, you know, I'm trying to help with two different coin shops with what I'm doing. But yeah, uh, he has uh, other stuff besides coins. He has comic books. Uh, his wife makes wreaths that he sells. He's got cards. He's got all kinds of stuff. So look at look at Kevin at buyyoucoinsupplies.com. Uh, just tell him to advance, didn't you? So he knows that I did mention his name. So. I hope you enjoyed this quick short video. Oh, yeah. In the middle of that 10 row hunt, here's the results. From last night. So starting at 21, y'all see the weights of the cop of the rows. I mean, copper is a guy of each, out of each row. So 
so here's the 2009. So we got two Denver's and two Phillies. No wheat since that's from last week. And this is all 2017 Philadelphia uh, pennies. The total of three, three 10 row hunts of 193 coppers. The, uh, what we got last night was 194 grams or 6.84 ounces. And slightly over a pound and two ounces, I think, is what it was. I don't know what's going on with the videos. I try to upload. I just get the circle of death. So hopefully this one upload all right. So I'm going to cut it short. If you're new to the channel, like what you see, subscribe, leave a comment. Hit the thumbs up. It helps. Turn it on for future notifications. And um, next weekend, uh, we'll have another 10 more rows of pennies to go through. And currently, I've got a two-row two penny challenge going out to anybody who watches my channel. Get you two rows that have to be machine-rolled pennies from the bank. Open them up and post them to YouTube. And see what you get. There's uh, I got a point system on the video where I did my two coin hunt, my two roll hunt this past Sunday. So there's a point system for what you get. I didn't put anything in, anything down for Indian head tents, I think. So y'all have a good evening. Hope you enjoyed the video.